Hallelujah. Glory be to God, family. I am super happy to be with you all again in the name of Jesus. For today is another beautiful day that the Lord has made. We will all rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Your person is trying to tell you that I know I hurt you and I don't want to hurt you again. I know I have hurt you and I don't want to hurt you again. If you're seeing me for your very first time, this is Prophetic Work with Adele. I just want to appreciate my returning subscribers for coming back. And if you're new, you're welcome to the family. God bless you abundantly. Thank you for being part of this amazing family. Father, in the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus, I thank you for the life of your children. I thank you for those that are connecting. Holy Spirit of God, I pray that may you come and guide and protect us. Guide our going out and coming in in the name of Jesus. I pray for each and every member of this house that may you grind their heart desire answer their prayer requests show them clarity and confirmation in the mighty name of jesus father we cannot do without you without you we are nothing holy spirit i take it again without you we are nothing we bow before the throne of grace grace we glorify your holy name we thank you father for there is no like you thank you for always being there for us guiding and protecting us in jesus mighty name we pray amen i pray that let this video should not pass you by that god will keep you increase you and let his covenant to shine upon you in the mighty name of jesus hallelujah praise the name of the lord thank you jesus your person is saying that i know i have hurt you i don't want to hurt you again i know i have hurt you i don't want to hurt you again yes your person hurts you you were so angry you were so angry for what they did to you. It wasn't their intention. You know, sometimes we do hurt each other without knowing. This person might hurt you without knowing that they are hurting you. But deep down, when you think about it, you are so hurt. And this person is saying that they are sorry that they hurt you, that they will not hurt you again. They don't want to hurt you again. I don't know who I am talking to, but this is the prophetic word that I got. I don't know who I'm talking to, but right now you're so angry in your spirit. You are so angry in your spirit because you trusted your partner so much. You love and care for your partner and your partner hurts you. And this, this, this makes you, you were so traumatized after uh, uh, what your partner did to you. And your partner never realized that they hurt you the way you were hurt inside. So, what happened is, they are sending you a message that it is now they realize that they hurt you, that they don't want to hurt you again. If they, are, if they have hurt you so badly, that really, that if they have made something that hurts you so badly, they are really sorry that they don't want to hurt you anymore. Hallelujah. You see, this person is sending you a message because they come to realize that without you, life is tough. Without you, things are difficult. They love you so much that they want to be with you. They are sorry that they hurt you. Okay? They did something wrong that it really hurt you. But now they just realize that what they did, it was very wrong. So they are coming with their whole heart, their sincere heart, just to tell you that they are sorry for what they did. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. They know what they did to you. It was so, so wrong. That is why they said, I know I hurt you and I don't want to hurt you again. I don't want to hurt you again. I don't want to hurt you again. If you can give me a second chance, I will prove to you that I don't, I will never hurt you again. I am. I don't intend hurting you again. Hallelujah. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Other people were trying to tell me that what I was doing, it was wrong. They tried to correct me, but I didn't listen to them until I have to lose you, until you have to walk out of my life before I come to realize that what they were telling me, it was correct. But I never give them the chance, I never give them the listening ear to listen to what they were telling me. They told me that I am hurting you, but I didn't know that at that point I was hurting you. So, they are just sending you a message telling you that they know that they are hurting you, that 
they will never do it again they will never do it again in the name of jesus i don't know who i am talking to right now but i just want to assure you that you know some people and when they are doing something without knowing without their intention they are not doing it intentionally you see someone who hurts you without knowing that they are hurting you okay maybe they'll be hurt there are so many ways that you can hurt somebody by action by words by ignorance okay like action you can talk to somebody the person will just look at you and without answering you ignoring you that is one of the way that you are, you are hurting somebody another way is like someone who texts you you open the message without reply that hurts a lot i can remember i had a friend that i love texting all the time but each time i text this my friend the person will just open the message without reply it will hurt me will pain me inside and i'll ask myself that why am i taking time to write this person then this person does not even have time to reply me that is one of another thing that hurts you might be hurt i don't know which way your person has hurt you maybe by ignoring you might maybe by saying words to you that they were not supposed to say maybe by doing some things that they were not supposed to do i don't know which way your partner have, may have hurt you but i am here to tell you that your partner is saying that they are sorry they will never hurt you again they are sorry they will never hurt you again if you could give them a second chance they will make things right they will correct things right this time around and they will never hurt you again in the mighty name of jesus this message is for those that believe in god if you believe in god you trust him you know that he can change your situation he can answer your prayer request you can answer he can answer you wherever when what whatever what Whatever you call him, wherever you call him. <laughs> oh my goodness. You know, guys, don't, 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 don't laugh for sometimes English is very tight. It's very, uh, you understand? Yeah. God is ready to do something for you in the mighty name of Jesus. All I will tell you is just believe in him, trust him, have faith in him. You will see him manifestation in your life in the mighty name of Jesus. You see, they are even saying to you that, the thought of you is driving them crazy. The thought of you is driving them crazy. Actually, they can't really do without you. It is so tough without you. Life is so difficult. It's so cruel without you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. Just keep having faith in God. Keep trusting Him. Before you know it, God has done something mighty in your life. Before you know it, God has done something big in your life. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you're finding it useful, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Turn on your notification bell and hit on the subscribe button. Now, may the good Lord keep you cause his face to shine on you. May he give you peace in Jesus' mighty name. Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow you all the days of your life. You shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. I love you so much and God loves you more. Always remember to pray. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. Stay blessed.